My best friend called me up the other day, just like two or three days ago, and asked me if I wanted to go to the beach with her, the spur of the moment trip. Of course I said yes. We drove up last night, or drove down. <coughs> She's still a little nasally and coughing, so we're hoping that salty air will help her feel a lot better, but... <laughs> we got in about 2.30 last night. She did really well. She slept most of the time on the way up here. I slept in my makeup. My makeup's still on my face. Mm -hmm. I even take a shower and wash my face and stuff. But yeah, so that's where we're at. We're at the beach. I just want to kind of fill you guys in on what we had last night on our way to the beach because it was like a seven and a half hour drive. We did do most of the, of the yeah. drive. We started at like seven o'clock. Here she comes. <laughs> You're silly. So we did most of the drive at night and normally I don't eat past seven but I don't know something about driving. We were up past what I normally go to bed what time I normally go to bed so I was so hungry so I brought pumpkin seeds that I have baked and I just put some butter and salt on them tastes like popcorn so good and I had a protein bar which was probably not the best as far as health wise but it only had five grams of net carbs and since yesterday was a low carb day I needed to stick to that and then I had some strawberries which they're really low on the glycemic index for carbs that's what I had on the way up here and just lots of water. Had to stop and pee for three times. So we are about to go to eat breakfast. I fasted this morning, did my um, walk on the beach, would be my fasted cardio, just steady state, nothing, nothing big. And I tried to do my cold shower this morning. Brian just kind of gave me this whole routine that he said, quote, I'm not training you, but I asked him what he would have me do if he was training me. So he told me everything and I'm trying to just like abide by it. Um, but he was gonna have me do some cold contrast showers. Sorry, I'm watching her. There's a lot of breakable stuff in here. I'm just, uh, the cold, the shower was not very cold. The ocean was a lot colder, but I couldn't get in the ocean with Sayla. So maybe I'll do that later, but we're about to head to breakfast. And um, I don't know what we're gonna get into later, but that's what we're gonna get started on. So we just got back from a day full of shopping and we had to go to the grocery store to get some food. I'm snacking on some pineapple right now and so is Miss Sayla. Bye. So I wanted to show you guys what we got. I try to cook while I am on vacation even still. This morning we had breakfast out but it's because we didn't have time to go get anything. Whenever you're shopping at the grocery store you want to try to do it in like the outskirts of the grocery store. There's a couple of things that I would say is okay to get in the middle of the grocery store like in the aisles but for the most part like your fruits and vegetables your meats are going to be on the outskirts of the grocery store so I will show you what all we got first off I got some fresh cut pineapple 
which is technically not on the lower carb part of things, but I've only had one meal today and I'm starving right now, so this was quick and I'm just gonna have a couple of them. But for my second meal of the day, I'm gonna have a salad, a really big salad. So I got this organic baby arugula and baby spinach mixture. And normally I will go to Earth Fair or Whole Foods or something like that, but Walmart was the closest and I was pretty surprised at their organic selection that they had. So I got two of those so that I could have a really big salad tonight. And then I got Sela a sweet potato. I got three Gala apples. Now these are not organic. They didn't really have that organic choice. So I'll just wash this off and it'll be good for the night. Two cucumbers. I got some uncured bacon, which means it's, there's no sugar in there, so it's gonna be low carb, and there's no preservatives or anything like that. So this stuff tastes amazing. Like, I don't understand why you would need cured bacon, like the added sugar and stuff, because this tastes really good, especially if you like salty. So I got that. That's gonna be for breakfast, but I'll probably fry some up and put some on my salad too, to add some extra fat. A mixture of organic baby carrots. I've never had the different colored carrots before, so I'm pretty excited about that. But like in my last vlog, I was talking about doing um, a rainbow of food. So I wanted to get some good color onto my salad. Organic chicken. Mm. You wanna show everybody what you're eating? I got organic eggs, and I'm gonna boil a couple of these for my salad, and then in the morning we'll have scrambled eggs and bacon. This is my favorite chicken marinade. It's Stubbs. Um, there's only 10 calories per serving. A serving is t one tablespoon, and then there's three grams of carbs. So um, we'll probably use like three or four tablespoons yeah. for the whole pack of chicken. It's really flavorful and it's really good. I got ranch dressing, of course, organic ranch, really good, and it's low carb as well. Some white mushrooms that I'll probably sa saute up with my chicken. And last but not least, I got some Himalayan pink salt. So. I'm about to whip up some lunch, a very late lunch for us. It is like three o'clock or four o'clock. Sailor's had a couple of snacks, but that's it. So we are starving. And then we're gonna go down to the beach and hopefully I can uh, film for you guys a quick uh, fat burning full body workout so that you guys can see you don't necessarily need a gym to work out with, especially if you're on vacation or whatever. So, because this is a girl's trip. They got Britt. Hi. <laughs> I haven't gotten her in here yet because we've just been so busy doing everything else. Whenever I first started this morning, she and Maddie were still asleep, luckily, or <laughs> lucky for them, not luckily, lucky for them. And I had to get up really early, so I'm starting to get kind of really sleepy. So hopefully this food will give me some energy to get this workout in.
So it's the next day guys and we just finished up our workout. We didn't end up doing like a really long workout just because my stomach was hurting. I think I ate too soon before working out, but you do what you gotta do. So we are going to head out and go shopping today, but I wanted to end the vlog here. But before I ended it, I have to show you what I got Sayla yesterday. I got her her first pair of Nikes. How cute are those? Yeah, do you like them? Do you like them? And then um, I also got me some new pair of Nikes as well. So they were on sale. I think those were 40 bucks. And then Sayla's, I hate to say it, but I paid $30 for those. But they're really cute. And they're a little bit big on her, so she'll be able to wear them for a longer time. So, but you want to say bye, Britt? Bye. <laughs> All right, guys. Um, I will see you guys at my next vlog. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button. And give this video a thumbs up if you liked it and enjoyed it. And don't forget, you can follow me on Instagram too. So, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!